Hey, what's up everybody? Coach from Sports Gambling Daily here. I'm obviously on the road. I'm not home in my studio, so uh, I'm actually traveling to West Virginia. Hope you guys understand. Um, I, I'll be back at the end of the week here, so we'll get back to our regular schedule. Sorry for these late videos. All right, we got the Bulls versus the Pacers. Bulls minus one in this matchup here. Um, um, 226 is the total. I'm Coach from Sports Gambling Daily. Thank you so much for checking out the channel. Definitely consider subscribing. All right, the Bulls 16 and 6 on the road. Straight killers on the road for the most part against the spread. Now they just beat the Nets uh, straight up in their last game. They finally get a win. It snaps a six game losing streak. It's the first win with, uh, with when since Vucevic has joined the team. So it was nice to get that monkey off his back. Now they've covered their last three games in a row. And um, look, for this game, uh, Kobe White is probable, which is huge because he was out last game. And you could always use a little bit of Kobe White on your team. And uh, Daniel Thice, he is considered out for this matchup. So uh, when you look at the Pacers here, now they are the complete opposite at home. 6-16 six and 16 against the spread at their house. Now they just beat San Antonio uh, in overtime in their last game. They scored like 139 points. Um, they did that without... Sabonis, so Brogdon, and Jeremy Lamb in the lineup. And all three of those guys are actually questionable for this game as well. Now, um, that did snap a three-game losing streak that the Pacers were on. And, um, you know, it also snapped the three games that they didn't cover in a row either. Now, when I look at this game, I mean, immediately I turned to the Bulls. And this line opened up at plus one and a half to the Bulls, which I was a little surprised. Now, the issue here is, you know, the Bulls cover a lot of these spreads when they're getting a lot of points, right? Um, they're not getting a lot of points in this matchup. Uh, they're actually, they're giving up points now. And the fact that the line moved from plus one and a half to minus one and a half tells me maybe two things. That maybe the public's all over the Bulls. And two, maybe, probably, one or not two of these starters are going to be out for the Pacers. Either Sabonis or Jeremy Lamb. Now, I like what the Bulls do on the road. I like what the Bulls are as a team. And I do feel like they're starting to get a little bit of continuity and a little bit of... Um, you know, chemistry going on here. So I'm going to lean the Bulls in this matchup, and I'll probably also lean the over 226. Um, they're just leans, though, at this point. There's nothing definitive. If you want the bets that I'm, I'm completely interested in, or I should say completely um, confident in, those are the ones that I give out on my website, sgdwins.site. The link for that site is in the description of this video. We went 4-0 uh, in our la yesterday on our VIP plays, and Actually, the last two days, we've been 6-2. and two. So, um, let's continue rolling there. Uh, guys, I'm Coach from Sports Gambling Daily. Thank you so much for checking out this video. Uh, consider subscribing. And uh, I'll be back in the studio probably on Friday. Get these uh, videos back on an earlier, uh, you know, more, um, what's it called? A more routine schedule. So, all right, guys. Thank you so much. Good luck with all your wagers. We'll see you on the next video. Peace.